तो टोटल ट्वेंटी थाउजेंड टायर नीड टू बी एक्सपोर्ट ओके फॉर द ट्वेंटी थाउजेंड टायर वी हैव क्लासिफाइड वेनर्स ऑफ द टायर्स लाइक ए कार टायर ट्रक टायर्स ट्रैक्टर टायर्स अगेन कार एंड जे सी बी टायर सो दिस ऑर्डर वी रिसीव फ्रॉम द ओवरसीज ओके सो वी रिसीव दिस ऑर्डर फ्रॉम द साउथ अमेरिका एंड वी हैव टू डिस्पेज दिस ट्वेंटी थाउजेंड टायर्स फ्रॉम डिफरेंट डिफरेंट लोकेशन ऑफ द इंडिया ओके तो गाइज here we are sitting in india and from india we have to dispatch this 20000 tire to the south america okay so namaskar friends welcome to export import make in india campaign and today in the session we will understand how we will execute the processing of the export production planning okay so in previous session we have understand for the manufacturing of the 20000 tire we have import the raw material which is rubber 10000 metric ton from the united states okay so that session was also important so you can watch go to the playlist and watch okay so in the session we will understand after importing this 10000 metric ton rubber in different different location we need to manufacture this 20000 tires okay so this is the uh, forecasting of the manufacturing just like a in november we need to manufacture the 3000 tires okay then in december 2900 tires okay so these are the tire manufacturing and once this tire is ready the intimation need to be given to the logistic team they will arrange the empty containers for the dispatch planning okay so let's start the session okay so in this session once we receive the order from the sales team okay here we are the logistic team and we receive order from the sales team and what sales team do sales team contact to the overseas buyers okay and they proceed this order so what they will do as per receive the order of purchase order need to be punched in sap okay so order need to be punched in sap okay you can see the this order need to be punched in the sap so how will this order need to punch as per requirement of the buyer like a car tire truck tire tractor tire and jcb tire this tire order need to be punched in sap in such way that this order will reflect in the respective factory production team okay they will manufacture the same and intimate the logistic team okay so here what is the procedure procedure is just like a first we need to prepare the perform invoice okay and the per, as per the perform invoice the buyer will give us the purchase order and once we receive the purchase order through the sales team sales team punch this order to the sap okay this will be the create the service sales order okay and this sales order punch to this the different different unit wise okay once this order is punched in sap the production team of mp will see that there are 5 5500 tire need to be ready as per the given time if rajasthan production team will see there are 400 tires need to be ready in the maharashtra team production team will see the 900 tires in the up production will will see the 500 tires in the same way haryana production team will see there are 700 tires so there are 3000 tires need to be manufactured in the month november okay so this is the procedures how the sales team punch the order to the production team and production teams as per requirement they manufacture the tires and make ready for the dispatch okay so here this order is punched and material is ready okay so as per sales team this order is punched 
then this reflected in the production team and they prepare this uh, pr- uh, they they manufacture the requirement as per the requirement okay and they ready this goods as per the given order okay then here this production team will intimate to the logistic team okay to arrange the empty containers for the dispatched okay so there is a very important step which logistic team will do before preparing and ready this manufacture process the logistic team will appoint the freight forwarders okay so they intimate the locations like a factory location to the destination and ask the rate it's like a rajasthan to bolvia okay rajasthan to peragua rajasthan maharashtra to brazil so the different different requirement is sent as a rfq request for the quotation to the different different freight forwarder okay and they need to be checked that this different different requirement need to be completes as per the as per rate rate received from the different different freight forwarder okay so here we need to check out who is providing the best pricing and the best service level we will appoint the freight forwarder okay after the approval of the management then next step is preparing the commercial and the packing list okay so this is the step here once we appoint the freight forwarder and this this freight forwarder will arrange the booking for this shipment okay which we are share the dispatch planning okay so first in initial stage we just take the rate from the different different freight forwarder like a freight forwarder 1 freight forwarder 2 freight forwarder 3 freight forwarder 4 okay then after this process we will check out which freight forwarder giving the best pricing with best service level okay then we will appoint as per the approved by the l1 l2 lowest one lowest two lowest three basis to the this freight forwarder okay so then the freight forwarder we need to share the in, in information of the planning like a we need the containers like a 10 containers we need for the rajasthan factory to the uh, brazil okay and that this the volume is this okay so type of container and requirement plus location of the factory and the destination need to be intimate as a sharing of the commercial rules and basis of these details what freight forwarder will do freight forwarder will book the container from the shipping line and up this container need to be reported at the factory as per the given time and date okay so this is the process of the many production planning of the 20000 20000 tires from the different different unit of the india and this order received from the south america okay so guys we are just going to end the session here in the next session we will understand what is the dispatch planning for this 20000 tires okay so in the next session we will understand the, there are 20 tires can be stuck in one container so we need to appoint this a requirement of the containers okay so guys thank you for watching the session have a nice day